Hi guys, this is one only by Nikki. Welcome to another cooking video, guys. So it's just me today in the kitchen. Thank you guys so much for the love and support and all the appreciation, all the beautiful comments, all the share, all the beautiful people that come and subscribe to my new, new channel, the new subscriber. Welcome to the Nikki family. One love, guys. Welcome to the family. So thank you guys for joining today. Big up to all my subscribers and all my supporters thank you guys so much for the love and support and big up everyone around the world who take the time to watch me and comment in my video even the silent watchers i do appreciate you guys thank you so much so today i'll be cooking some tilapia curry with coconut milk inside and rice so as you can see over here i have all my ingredients i went ahead and prep up all my ingredients and um Cut it up and put it up together. So as you can see, everything is here. It wouldn't probably would not be a long video, but um, everything is right here. As you can see here, I got a half a teaspoon of grind ginger, um, grind jeera, two teaspoon of garlic. Here I got some nice fresh tilapia from the Chinese West Indian store on Central Ave. Um, Chinese West Indian store, I'm sorry, on Central Ave. This is live tilapia. Um, and here um, is my ingredients. I got ho a, whole, a whole small onion, aji, masala, two teaspoon of masala, two teaspoon of curry powder, four weary pepper, five weary pepper, two tomato, celery, shallot, mint leaf, parsley right there and i got my garlic and um ginger there to grate this this um garlic is for something else i put it here before you have to use it but the ginger is for the curry okay and it's coconut milk so this is how everything looks so far So um, I already washed my rice, throw it in, I already throw salt, my salt inside. So the rice is on um, there, cooking. I'm going to turn my stove on for my curry. And then it's the canary or the curry, you say, get hot. And I'm going to go ahead and open my coconut milk in the meanwhile. There it goes. So once again, like I said, thank you all so much for the love and support. And of course, make me rest in cheer right here. All right, show them. Show them here. I get my rest in cheer. All right, to me stool day. So I'm tired. Stand up. Must sit down. I'm tired. Sit down. I'll get up and cook. All right. So that's how we do my video in the kitchen. Just being 100% real, as you can see, my limp limb can't can find my time, but that's okay, right? I have to push extra. myself and move my body a little bit, right? So, the water is bottled in the car here. I'm gonna add my island side now. So, once again, big up to everybody. Who show love and support to my channel you all know who you are in my last video I shout out everybody and i do appreciate all you guys love and support one love always from the nikki family and it's always going to be like that this is what you see this is what you're going to get guys okay nothing less nothing more love you all So guys, I'm going to drain my piece of ginger first in the aisle, let it fry up a little bit. So guys, don't worry about the smoke, the vent is on, it's going to pull it out, okay? So I'm going to go ahead now and put my garlic. I'm 
I'm going to show you my um, celery. My masala. My curry powder. My parsley, mint leaf, and shallot. Grind jeera. Half a teaspoon of grind jeera inside the curry, guys. Give it a nice, delicious, handsome, good looking flavor like me. Hey, look at that, guys. Look at that beautifulness in there. Look at that. Look at that. Guys, excuse me, my high pitched voice, right? I try to push myself to do this video every single time. And it's not easy doing a video, guys. Add my weary pepper. And. Adding my tomato to cook up with the masala. Nice fresh tomato. So guys, I'm adding my salt. Now you average your salt and put it inside. You don't put a lot, but I average my salt, okay? Mm. So guys, this is how everything look. I just add a little bit of water so far. Look at all this deliciousness in here. Let me just put the light on a little bit so you can see a little better. Because this light, if I put it on, I show dark inside, so I have to turn it off. Look at this, guys. Look at all this good deliciousness. I'm going to add my coconut milk in a second. Let it sponge up a little bit. Then I'm going to add my coconut milk inside. So here is the coconut milk going in. So you get to have a little bit of thickness inside in the bottom too, guys. You gotta shake it up real good. Mm. Yeah, shake it, shake it, shake it, shake it. Shake it, baby, shake it. Then go along in the canary. Shake it, coconut milk, shake it, and go down with it, tilapia. Bunje in the kahari, here we are, bunje in the kahari. Alright, guys. Mmm, look at this. So, guys, it was nice, like, if we continue to get fresh fish over here. But, we don't need to fresh, let's see if we want to get a live tilapia. You gotta go to the Asian Chinese store. That's the only place you're gonna have the live tilapia. Otherwise, everywhere else is get the freeze freeze one. And it's nice, That's like awesome. to like when you get the fresh mullet tilapia, the fresh hassa, and everything. It's nice. It tastes much better. So you don't have to um, no thing that it's been like in the freezer for long. But if you don't have the fresh one, you have to deal with the frozen one. So that's how everything look. I'm gonna cover it, let it boil now. In the meanwhile, the rice is cooking. Mm. Yeah? Oh, mm -hmm. so guys, here I cut some okra, I already washed it. I'm gonna put it inside, I like okra, my fish curry. So I put six okra. Three for me and three for them. So look at this guys, look at this fish curry. Oh god guys. You guys thought this was gonna be delicious fish curry. You can tell by the color alone, look at this. Actually everything is fresh in here. Oh la la. So here how's everything look guys? This is the curry. Look at that deliciousness guys, look. Like I said, that's the fresh tilapia from the Asian store on Central Ave. That's the only place you can get the fresh tilapia, like I said. Otherwise, you get the frozen one from the West Indian store. Or, like, um, Restaurant Depot. Or, um, 
Hams Club or um, um the the Asian store in Albany. That's the only place you're gonna get the um the frozen tilapia and the fresh tilapia you get at the Asian store. So that's how everything look, guys. Take a look. So she's eating some biscuits over there. Look at that. She just got out of work, so. <laughs> That record. So guys, as you can see, I sit on get my chair right now. My back is kind of bothering me, so I'm sitting in a chair, and my is cooking right there, as you can see. As you can see, the curry is boiling nice. The tilapia doesn't take that long to boil. As you can see, already boiled. So I just I just throw in a little bit of water more. So the okra can boil or steam a little bit. I don't like the okra too soft. I like it like a, it should like a little bit hard. I don't like it like too soft and it's too soft in the outside. And this is young okra too, so that's the reason why I, I don't want it to boil too soft. And as you can see, the the rice is almost done too. She wash some wheels over there. She says she want pot set, so. There she washing some wish there with some dishes. You buy from the Kali name you get hiccup. Pulling out some curry powder guys. The curry powder back empty, so I'm gonna restock it. No, no. Melala Indian Indian Western Western curry powder. Lala. <laughs> It's in the ram curry powder, but I just save out, I just put part of it, okay? It's in the curry powder. So I buy this one, Lala, and after it's finished. Lala. It's a, yeah, Lala's. Did you want that? So Lala, curry powder I just buy, but it's finished, and um, I'm just talking with the um, in the curry powder. So guys, she a camera little laughing because I can't see the name properly, because <laughs> I pull out some teeth and when I try to say the Lala, it sounds like Lala's, okay? <laughs> it's Lala. And I have no teeth in the bottom here, so the words come out as Lala's, no Lala's. So you pull now guys, okay? I'll get that rag here because it's spilled, it's falling the rag a little bit. So you done, I still have some in here. So guys, here is the tilapia curry, cooked and built tilapia curry finish. Look how good it looks. Look at that. The rice is done. I just strained the rice. Sorry for the little mess in the curry here because. I turn it up, that's the reason why it gets so messy, okay? Hello beautiful subscribers and followers. Thank you guys so much for the love and support. So today, okay, in my earlier video, I cooked with tilapia curry, cooking milk style. I have my rice, and some salad, and this is my beautiful fresh tilapia from the Asian store in um, Albany. It's beautiful. So, as you can see here, I have the fresh tilapia. I take the head part, the two okra, and we re pepper and some salad in the end. The kids have the same thing, and they have juice, and I have my um soda. So dig in. As you can see, this is what I was talking about. You see the okra bile is soft and nice. It's not like melt out. That's why I like my okra, and of course I get a weary pepper. So you know I have to burst one first.
Good. I'm going with my hands so the kids eating with a spoon um today. <laughs> the curry tastes really good, but she likes the sky pinky. Yeah, Tilapia. Tilapia. Oh. Yeah, tilapia is good. This is sky pinky. Love you. So here we go guys. The first one. Always for the subscribers. I'm going in with some tilapia and rice and some salad on top. First one, whatever tea to all the wonderful subscribers and all the salad watchers also. Delicious guys, delicious. Second one. Shout out, shout out to my dad for making it. So thank you guys once again for the love and support. We do appreciate. If you're not like and subscribe yet, please do hit the like and subscribe button, share, and the notification icon on. Same time, post a video notification. One love. Welcome to the family. We do appreciate you guys. All those who celebrate birthday, anniversary, happy birthday, happy anniversary. And thank you once again. One love. Peace out.